AJ? Yep. Saw you in Dallas last week. Yeah. Everything, every conversation about this all. I probably didn't come to Florida to see me in the Florida to see the AJ. You see what I'm saying? You've been bullshitting, man. What? You've been bullshitting. What? You went all the way to Dallas to see AJ, you didn't go to Florida to see me. You've been bullshitting. I didn't man. think you were going to take the fight. You'd be bullshitting, man. I didn't think you were going to take you the gotta fight. you got to stop that. Yeah. you got to stop that. Seriously. Okay. Yeah. I didn't think you'd take the fight. You didn't think I'd take the fight? No. You're going to Mexico anyway. You didn't visit the fight. Yeah, I was going. I was going Dallas to Mexico. Uh, it was on a stopover. Uh, okay, I can I ask one you. question? Go on. What does AJ's balls taste like? <laughs> <laughs> you might find out. <laughs> 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 yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Snappy comeback from Eddie Hearn after getting caught in a lie by Dylan the body snatcher White, and he told him that he wasn't in the states or he wasn't going to come by, but he's seen AJ. And Dillian White called him out on it, and let me counterpunch. Um, fair play to Dillian White. You know, that's what you're supposed to do. That's what made this press conference ever more this exciting, simply because, you know, there was uh, pretty high moments of mediocrity. You know what I mean? Until that happened. And Dillian White, you know, just shows you that he calls people out on things if he hears a lie. It's like, hey, man, you got to stop that shit seriously. You know, so he first of all checked him and then put him in his place and told him what to do and what not to do. But it was hilarious. And Eddie Hearn spinned it around as a joke, you know, the teabagging and how's, uh, you know, uh, uh, AJ's nuts taste like and stuff like that. So, you know, he, he really did uh make a snappy comeback but it only showed he was defensive like that because he had to be because he was caught in a lie you know and it just shows you like the little white lies that happen and when people are familiar with them and the ability to call someone out not wait till after the press conference say man i thought you wasn't in the united states you know all this that and the other and then you know eddie Hearn, oh, i thought you was signed, wouldn't sign in the contract you know what i mean those type of things so we've heard Dillian White say also that he didn't hear anything from Team Hearn or any of that when he was calling Hearn, but now and found out Hearn was over there visiting AJ. Mm. Sounds very interesting. But you guys tell me what you think of Dillian White aggressively calling out Eddie Hearn for lying to him. Of course, please subscribe. And you guys been Counterpunch. Peace!